Wait here. I'll be back before you know it. Literally. Binky? <laughs> it's you! Yield! I may be merciful. Never! Thus it ends, boy. Mort! My name is Mort! I, I love him, Father! You do? You never said. Be silent! Mother. Father. I invite you into my home. I train you, I feed you, I clothe you, I give you opportunities you could not dream of, and thus you repay me. <sighs> my birthmark. You seduce my daughter from me, you neglect the duty, and you make ripples in reality that will take a century to heal. Your ill-timed actions have doomed your comrades to oblivion. The gods will demand nothing less. All in all, boy. Not a good start to your first job. You're right. There's no justice. There's just you. Stand aside. No! Mother, you you I told. never knew. I will not! Why did you never tell me? No, I cannot be forced. I will only do that which I know to be right. <gasps> you don't know how sorry this makes me. I might do. <laughs> you better come out. I can't talk to you. You're just going to lurk in the dark. Hello? How do you know who I am? I have a unique memory. You can't remember me. I haven't even been conceived. I did say unique. Your name is... Susan. But... Susan. They really wanted to make sure, didn't they? Yes, but... Tell me, was I... Will I be... Am I... A good grandfather. If I tell you, won't that be a paradox? Not for us. Well, you've got bony knees. You came back in time to tell me that. No, you've gone missing in the future. And you're having to do the duty, I see. No, you don't. Uh, interest. What's it mean, Grandad? Grandad. Grandfather I can live with, but Granddad. You'll be calling me Gramps next. Grandfather, I need to know. Whoever he is, he has no life. He has only music. Music? Rhythm in his soul, literally. You mean music has taken him over? You could put it like that. Making his life longer? Human life is extendable, but he is not human. He is music. He played a guitar. An old guitar? Yes, I don't know. Fascinating. What? Well, nothing important. Just a piece of mythological debris. Debris? It's a parasite. It'll kill him. He'll be dead in a few days. That's terrible. Are you romantically involved with this young man? What? No. I've only seen him once. Across a crowded room. No. Don't get involved, child. You can't change anything. You did. I just saw you. My parents. I may have allowed myself a flicker of emotion. I can give it up any time I like. Why shouldn't you change things if you can make the world a better place? I should never have adopted your mother. You're scared. Scared to change the world. You say that to me? You prattle on about changing the world? Could you find the courage to accept it, to know what must be done, and to do it, whatever the cost? There is what is, and 
what will be. If you change the fate on one individual, you change the world. And you, you carry the responsibility for the change. And that is always too heavy to bear. That's just an excuse. When it comes down to it, Susan, who are you? A deputy? A girl in a school nightdress? What do you know? What can you do? You were saying? I'll see you in another dimension. Susan! What? Really? Bony knees? Yes!